guys. Today we are making a craft today. And what is it, Cassidy? We have a brace bracelet. We're gonna make a bracelet. So today we're talking about the shield of faith. And so to remind us of that, we're going to make a bracelet that we can wear that reminds us that we have faith wherever we go. So there's two versions. The first one is for my younger friends and it simply looks like this and it's round and you can decorate it however you want. So to do this one, you take one piece of duct tape and you can always make it shorter. So we wanna start with a long piece. You can't make it longer once you cut it. So you can make a piece about 14 inches and what you're going to do is you're going to fold the duct tape in half. You want to put your finger in the middle? Good job. And we're going to fold it down like this. And then we're going to fold the other half in towards it and make sure you cover all the sticky part. And then it won't stick to us. And we're going to fold it down. Good job. Alright, so this is basically our bracelet. It's almost done. Then you could add colors to it, you could add shapes to it, and then you can write faith, and then you would measure your wrist. We'll take Cassidy's wrist. And this one is a lot bigger than her wrist, so then you could cut it down and tape it together. Let's cut it down a little bit. Still too big, so we're gonna cut it down and tape it together and then you have a bracelet and again you can write faith. The other one you're going to do is a braided version of the bracelet and this one's going to be a little bit harder to write on. So at the back piece you could write faith right here, a little cross, but this is a fun way to braid it and to have just a fun bracelet. So what do we need for that craft? Can you tell us our supplies? We need tape. Okay. We need scissors. We need markers. Alright, so this one just needs tape basically. So what you're going to do is you're going to take a big strip of duct tape and again you can always make it smaller so you want to start out big, right? Yeah. Okay, so this one is about 14 or 15 inches and we're going to cut it. Can you hold the bottom for me? Alright, so we're going to end up cutting this piece in half. So it's a little bit tricky so if you have a hard top, you could do it. I usually stick it like this, and then I can cut it like this. And I just make small cuts so that I can keep cutting it right down the middle. And it doesn't have to be perfect because we're gonna fold it over again and then braid it. And sometimes your scissors get stuck and that's okay, just keep so moving you have along. A half. You're going to put it down and you're going to again fold it into itself into thirds like this. Good job. Let's, wait, we got to fold it this. Good job. And then we're going to fold it into itself. So again, there's no sticky part showing. It's going to be a really thin piece of duct tape. And you're going to do that with all three colors. And duct tape is stretchy so you can kind of stretch it and pull on it and that will help. You want to hold that strand? Alright, then we're going to do one that's a different color and the same thing. I'm going to fold it in. Alright, we almost have our second piece. We're going to fold that straight. Here's piece number two. I'm gonna fold that one. And then I decided to do green. So this one I'll fold in again. Okay, once you have all three strips, you're gonna line them up at the top like this. Okay, so they go like this. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna tape them together. So I have a piece of duct tape right here that I'm gonna put like this. And I'm gonna tape them all three together and kind of squeeze them tight like this. So now they're all three together and you can see this red one is a little bit longer but that's okay we'll cut it at the end. Then to braid them you either need someone to hold it 
Or again, you could go like this and you could use a piece of tape and tape it down. And Cassie, you want to hold it too. So it should stay. And then what you're going to do is you're going to braid it. So just like you would braid hair, you're going to put it over. You have three strands. Actually, I'll have you hold it so you can see. You know, hold it right there. So you have three strands and you're going to go under the blue. My blue comes over. My red goes over. My green comes over. And I'm going to just keep and kind of hold it tight so it's nice and tight when you do it. We're going to keep going. So my red goes over then it goes under the green. My green comes over. My blue goes over. And if you need help, maybe a parent can help you in this part. Keep going. Keep going, yep. This will be a great reminder that God is always with us and God is faithful and we can have faith. So this looks really big for Cassidy and this is what we're making for Cassidy. So if you want to cut yours, obviously you can cut it to size. And then you're going to tape the other bottom too to make sure that they stay together. So let's see. Oh, we're just about there. So what we're going to do is, I'm going to finish braiding a couple more. I'm going to stick it right here so it stays. And then I'm going to get another piece of tape. Do you want to hold that, Cassidy? Hold the braid? Good job. You want to, what color would you like to do? Green? I want to do blue. Blue, okay. So we need a little piece on the bottom to keep it all together. Just a really small, thin piece will work. And then again, if you, if you pull it really tight, it tightens the whole thing, which is good. There you go. Mm-hmm. All right, then we have this leftover, so we're gonna cut that off just like that. And then we're going to put them together. What color do you wanna to use to put them together? Um, pink. Okay. How can I cut it? You can help, yeah. Just need a small piece, again. Good job. I got it. Okay. So let me see your hand again. Let's see how we need to make it. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to wrap the two edges together. And again, duct tape does stretch some. So you can stretch it a little bit to get some more movement if you need it. So we have our braided bracelets to remind us that we have faith wherever we go, so have fun. I can't wait to see this on the night page, and have a great day. You ready to say goodbye? Bye. Bye, friends.